Okay, this is my Spyderco Shaman. Uh, I've added black zirconium scales to it, black zirconium backspacer, and a titanium deep carry pocket clip. Uh, this knife weighs way too much. Uh, I, I don't I don't know what it weighs offhand um, with all these additions, but uh, this is this is a great full sized carry knife. Uh, you know, it's got a huge choke up point. Uh, so many different ways to to, to hold this knife. Uh, you can really choke up if you need to cut through some thick material. Uh, the blade is is just a fantastic shape. Uh, it's a CPM S30V. Uh, I haven't sharpened it yet, so I can't speak on how easy that is to sharpen. Um, almost all of my knives are carry knives. I don't I don't have many uh, uh, safe queens. I, a few of my knives I planned to to never use, but I, I can't help myself so. Um, scratches and all that type of stuff on my knives are a common thing I, I, I don't care I don't plan on selling any of these <clears throat> I'm a collector and that's how it's always gonna be these knives are gonna stay in my possession likely forever uh, or until I pass them down to my son or something but I can't suggest the shaman enough uh, a lot of people complain about this nub here because when the knife closes, it that nub passes through the compression lock area and if you don't move your finger, that nub slams into your finger. And if you're a pussy, that's going to be a deal breaker for this knife. Uh, but honestly, within a few minutes of carrying it, you learn how to, to avoid that. And, uh, yeah, it's, uh, made in, uh, Golden, Colorado, USA Earth. It's one of the American Spider Co's. Um, you know, it just, the tolerances of this knife are, are perfect. They're, they, you know, they, they really know what they're doing there. Um, and it's just, it's just flawlessly put together. Uh, it's a joy to carry, a little heavy for some people with these added additions, but uh, no, this is, this is one of the best knives in my collection by far. Anyway, if you haven't handled the Spyderco Shaman, I suggest you get to a store that sells it, put it in your hand. I can almost guarantee you that uh, if you can get past compression lock, which I'm not the biggest fan of, uh, but... If you've got enough dexterity in your hands, this is this is a fantastic blade, and uh, will serve you well for however long you carry it for. Anyway, go check it out. Let me know what you think. Uh, have a good day, guys. Bye.